How to make a brochure in Canva. Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing day. I bring you back yet another Canva tutorial and in this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how you can make your very own brochure. And it's gonna be very easy. I'm gonna show you in the smallest and simplest of steps. And uh, you may need to make a brochure for your business handle or your social media handle or maybe for some workspace. And uh, I'm here for you. Uh, I'll tell you in the easiest ways and I'm gonna guide you through the whole video and by the end of the video You all will know how to make your very own brochure. So let's get right into it then So to make your brochure you first of all obviously need to go to canva.com now If you're not familiar with canva, you can check out my video that I made on How you can use canva. It's very easy. You just need to go and check out that video and uh, All will be easy and fine so let's get started. Once you understand the whole interface of Canva, what you're gonna know and do is go on this search bar right here because obviously you can't find the brochure down here. They don't give it in this space. So you're gonna need to go and search it. So you're gonna write brochure. Now when you write brochure, as you can see, it gives you two templates. Now click on any one of them depending on the dimensions you want. And uh, once you select it, it's gonna give you many, many templates regarding your brochures and look at that look at these amazing templates and they're all full of creativity they're all full of design and you can choose any one of them if you want to now you can either do this if you're short on time if you don't feel like creating one of your own from scratch you can just go on any of these already made templates and select them and then you can move on from there. Now, obviously there are a few templates that are gonna be for the pro trial. So if you wanna go ahead and buy the pro trial, you can do that. I'm gonna show you in the end of the video of how you can really do it. But if you wanna do the pro trial, you can go for that. But we're gonna show you how to make templates on the free trial. So obviously select any one of them of the free trial. For example, I'll select this one because I like its look. And uh, yeah. Once I select it, the template is going to open for me. And look at that, look at all these amazing designs. So now I can just write whatever my brand name is. For example, I'll write, I'll make a brochure for KFC. For example, I'll write KFC chicken. And once that is done, then I put in the phone number for KFC, the address of where it is. Then I'll put in the website. If I wanna put in some other graphics, for example, I'll go in elements, I'll write KFC and uh, obviously these are the paid ones you're just gonna find any free one you have or you can just go and use the trial or if you want to check out the free ones you're just gonna write something related to KFC for example chicken and look at that so we're gonna delete this we're gonna take this and we're gonna blink bring it here obviously this doesn't look the greatest but you get the idea and then you can just mess around with this and then you're gonna go on share click on download and then select your file type. Once you do that, then you're gonna download. And yeah, that's how you're gonna download your brochure. And yeah, this is the second page. Make sure to work on this too because there's a front page and the back page of the brochure. So yeah, this is basically how you can do it in a template form. But obviously, if you wanna create your own designs and you don't really wanna use an already given template, if your mind is that creative and you wanna go ahead and use that creativity and put it to some use, you can come back here and click on create a blank brochure. Now what this does is it gives you a blank canvas on which you can do whatever you like. You can run all kinds of things through it and you can use your imagination to your fullest. So obviously it gives you these three sections uh, and it also, it still gives you the templates if you wanna take inspiration from them. But uh, anyway, nonetheless, I'm gonna show you how to work around with this. So for example, first off, you're gonna choose the color of your brochures. So uh, let's choose any kind of color. Let's say I'll go with uh, a purple, a purple brochure. And as you can see, the lines still stay there. They don't get rid of the lines. So, well, here's my brochure. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start putting in my text. So take any type of good font and you're going to take, for example, I'll just take this one and I'm going to start writing things. For example, I'll write introduction. I'm gonna make it small so it fits in. I am just gonna do this. And then introduction to our project. And then we're just gonna make this small as well. There we go. 
and just select this, bring it here, select this, we're going to select it separately, and yeah. So we're just going to delete this, copy this, paste it, bring this right down here, and then change our text to our project. Now, just like that, you're going to put in every type of text you want, and then you're going to put in your images. For example, it's, if it's a project uh, considering uh, or revolving around Jim. So you're going to do that. Then you're going to take something related to your product or maybe your logo. And you're going to stick it right down here. There we go. And then you're going to put in uh, your address, your name, number, details. So you, we're just going to go on text. We're going to go on this. And we're going to put it right down here. And over here we're going to write, for example, uh, call us at and then you're gonna put in your number you can just write contact us at because that just seems better yeah so this is the first page of the brochure obviously you can fill it in with some funny elements you can just plug them out from here and you can change their opacity if you want to and once all of this this is done uh what you're gonna do is just mess around you it's basically all about how your imagination works then you can just go over here you can go in these dumbbells uh you can change the opacity and then you can flip them over you can make them smaller just so it looks like there's just something floating in the background then you can take this uh, bodybuilder image you can flip this over you can put it right here you can decrease the transparency and look at that basically this is how you make your brochure and then you're going to add your text in the middle file then you're going to add your text in the furthest file and after all of that what you're going to need to do is just go on share and then you're going to go on download now it depends on what kind of brochure you want if it's a digital brochure that you're just going to send online to everyone then your file type should be png but if you want to take printouts of your brochure then make sure to go for PDF print because this gives you the best quality of printed paper and once you've done all that yeah just download it and there you go that's gonna be your brochure and that is how easy it is to create your very own brochure it totally depends on your imagination and how you want to do it so once you're done with all that you're just gonna go back to home and if you want to see your saved projects you can just go on projects so yeah as you can see right there, it's being um, processed, but once it is processed, it's going to be there just like this one. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And if you want to go and buy the pro plan, you're just going to go on the home page and you're going to click on plans and pricings. Now, once you do that over here, you can see these three plans, free, pro and teams. So you're just going to click on pro and then you're going to put in your card details, banking account, whatever. And yeah, that's how you buy the pro plan. And that's how easy it is. I would not recommend that because the pro plan, it does give you a lot of amazing features. But I just use the free plan because the free plan give already gives you enough. So yeah, uh, that's about it. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. It helps me out a lot. Share the video, share them with your loved ones, your family. Comment down if you want to see more videos like this. And yeah, that's been me. I hope you all have a great day and goodbye.